Hello, my beautiful, beautiful friends. It's Stephanie Whipple, your personal wellness advocate, here today to talk to you about doTERRA's global convention. In this video, we will be covering what makes doTERRA essential oils pure, as well as the founder's favorite products and an inspirational quote I picked up along the way. Shall we? Let's go. All right, the founder's favorites. I'm not gonna name names. I'm going to list the products and you guys can list down below who you think likes which product. Number one, in no particular order, is the Rose Hand Lotion. This founder said that they like this product because it has made such an impact on the world. If you guys don't know, all sales from the Rose Lotion go directly to the Healing Hands Foundation, which is a nonprofit organization committed to improving lives through partnering with organizations that offer hope to millions around the world. I'm going to put the link to their website down in in the description box below and you guys can check them out. Number two is peppermint. Number three is cheer oil. Now the founder who likes this oil referred to it as their happy oil. Number four is Siberian fir and green mandarin and this founder likes to mix these oils together with fractionated coconut oil in a shaving product. Number five, this founder just could not help but share their top three favorite products. Number one was Yarrow Palm, number two is Immortelle, and number three was Rose. I love the smell of Rose. But this founder said that if you're on a deserted island and the only oil you have is Immortelle, you're set. And number six was Spearmint Oil. So why are doTERRA essential oils so pure? A big reason is we eliminate the middleman. Now the majority of oils found on the market today are bought by the company that they're from through a middleman. And the middleman wants to make money. So oftentimes he will buy at a very low price taking advantage of the farmers who grow the crops that get the oils. He will take the oils and he will adulterate them in some form or another. Take clove oil. There are three different parts of the plant of clove that you can get oil from. Now, the first is the bud, which is the most sought after oil, and the second is the stem, and the third is the leaf. Now, the big reason a lot of people like clove oil is because of its contents and the amount of eugenol in it. So, clove bud is the most sought after because it's got the most concentration of eugenol in it. But the middleman will often take stem oil as well and mix it in. And when you test this a lot of times, you can't tell the difference. But there is definitely a difference. And doTERRA is dedicated to finding the difference and making sure that people who ask for clove bud oil will get clove bud oil, not some adulteration. What's another way that doTERRA gets you the purest oil possible? Well, one way is testing, a lot. And one of these tests is called gas chromatography and mass spectronomy testing. Now, that's a mouthful, but it's also called GCMS. It tests what's present and in what amounts. Now, things like vitamins, hormones, minerals, proteins should not be present in an oil that is distilled properly. So what happens is through a very small tube, doTERRA runs the oil. And depending on what's in the oil, the chemical constituents should group together and come out on the other side in groups. Now, this is measured up to a standard of pure oil. And if it doesn't measure up to the standard, odds are it's not good and we don't give it to you. Another thing that doTERRA tests for is heavy metals. Now they do this through inductively coupled plasma mass spectroscopy, which is ICPMS. Now what happens in this process is they excite the particles in the oil, causing them to ionize, which means they undergo a positive or a negative charge, and then they stretch the substance so thin that they can detect each individual element to test what should not be there. Uh, they want the type and the quantity of elemental constituents in an essential oil, usually looking for things that don't belong there, such as lead or mercury or arsenic, making sure there are no heavy metals whatsoever. doTERRA is so engrossed in the farming 
the distilling and the testing of the essential oils, we hardly ever see adulteration anymore. And if we see adulteration, you can bet it's not in your bottle. I wanted to end on a quote I heard Emily Wright say, and I was interested in it, so I looked it up, and it was paraphrasing Thomas Carlyle. It said, if you have your health, you have hope. If you have hope, you have everything. And that's so true. I hope you guys enjoyed this so much. I love you guys. Bye. I hope you liked this video. If you did, please hit the like button. Remember, I'm here to support your goals of a healthy lifestyle, overall wellness, and a successful business. Do you have any questions about essential oils? Do you want to see more videos with me using doTERRA products? Please leave suggestions, questions, and requests in the comment section below. Essential oils support my goals for a healthy lifestyle that you should know I'm not a doctor. Hope to see you in the next video.